beauties my name is jazz and if you're new here welcome back to my channel where we discuss everything fashion beauty and lifestyle today i'm sure you guys want to know is everything i bought in paris video i have some other random things that kind of got shipped when i was away um that i want to show you guys as well but mostly going to be everything that i bought in paris if you did not watch the paris vlog be sure to check it out i'll put it in the cards and description up here so you guys can watch i had an amazing time with my mom you guys loved her i told her she's a star <laughs> um but check out that vlog um i had such a great time i didn't go for paris fashion week i just went for the vibes and the usher concert and of course the shop Shopping. um so i had a list i did so good i did so 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 good i had a list of the things that i wanted of course i like maxed out like as soon as i got the first thing but i got great things um great pieces and things that i think you guys will love so without further ado let's get right into it i don't even want to drag i'm gonna start with like the best purchase ever like the best purchase ever I'm in love with it. I'm so happy with it. I had such a great experience um, in the Gucci store in Rue La Marche um, in Paris. Um, Diana, who was my sales associate, she was so sweet, um, so kind. Um, everyone there was great. We had champagne, you know, pop a little bottle <laughs> um, for all that good stuff. But if you guys have watched my packing video for Paris, you guys know that I wanted this bag. So I got her and she is beautiful. And it is the Gucci horse fit bag in the red color and the size large. Um, so before going to Paris, of course, you guys know that I wanted this bag. It was on my wish list. And it's so funny. I have been looking for a red bag for a long time. And I just couldn't find one that took up my fancy. But as soon as I saw this, I knew I had to have it. And I wanted to go. You guys know I wanted the I Care St. Laurent tote. But I was like, you know what? Like, I had... I've achieved some great things like I want a bag that is fun a pop of color I don't want it in a black color I don't want it in a tan I want something that's gonna be fun bright all the things so this fit perfectly and as you know red is the color of the season and I just been feeling it so much more even with what I have on today just imagine just keeping your look simple and just having this perfect like pop um it's so amazing I'll give you guys like a quick review um just because I'm not going to do a separate review on this but um, it comes in, well, they told me it comes in, the the red came in the large size, but I believe the red comes in the large and the smaller size. I just felt like with the large, you can see more of the details of the actual shape of the bag. So I prefer this size. I had tried on both in the store because they have it in black and they also have it in white. And the white color, I love as well. But you guys know I wanted the red. So I just decided with this size because I just felt like it just looked a little bit better and it looked cooler because you can obviously hold it like this. One thing I do love about this bag is the this chain piece is removable, which I'll probably remove sometimes. Like I do like it for the added flair, um, but it can be taken off. It has removable straps. And also too, this strap is also removable, which is really awesome. And you can actually do it as a true clutch, which is like this, which is a great way to hold it. Um, when you open it, and maybe I'll show some footage on the side here, but when you open it, I didn't wear it like officially officially so I still have the paper in it and I want to keep it stock like this but it's a lot of room inside like it's not super deep but you can fit your phone you can fit a camera you can fit your lipsticks you can fit anything that you will want to take in the actual day-to-day -day bag of course it's not a tote bag but anything that you will want to fit as far as like your sanitizer lotion uh what else do we take with us um camera i took a camera iphone um those usual things like a hand lotion will fit inside the bag uh, and i actually really really i love it i'm in love with it um the color is just everything the size everything it's soft uh mm, mm, i'm obsessed i'm so obsessed i'm so excited about it i'm so grateful to have gotten this bag i'm just i'm so excited about it and also, too, I forgot to mention in the beginning, if you're watching this video, stay tuned to the end because we're going to do a 20K giveaway and I'm going to announce the date that we're going to have our live on YouTube, um, but also announce a giveaway at the end of this video. So if you made it this far, good thing you didn't click off because you would have missed the giveaway. I'm not sure what we're going to do. I feel like you guys love the gift card idea and I love the gift card idea because you guys get to choose where you want to spend your money and I don't want to tell you where you should um, or what you should buy or buy something for you. So I definitely want to do a gift card 
but I also want to do something fun. So stay tuned to the end of the videos while I announce the contest as well because we hit 20k guys, 20k. So I'm so excited. I appreciate you all for watching this channel, supporting this channel, supporting me. Um, it's been a long road and I appreciate you all. So stay tuned to the end. But this is the first thing that I got from Paris. Love, love, love. Just amazing. If you were thinking about it, if you're going overseas, if you're going to Italy or Europe, just go get your merchandise over there. But I love her. Let me know if you have any questions about more details in the comments and I'll be sure to answer them. But this was the first big girl purchase. And we don't have much more after this, but let's get into the next thing. Let me put this to the side. So the next thing you probably saw, if you did watch the vlog, this is on my list. I went on Loewe. Um, I will say Loewe is probably my favorite accessory brand. They just do glasses right. They just do everything right. They just do everything right. So I saw these on the website and I was like, oh, oh I need to have. They're like $500 on there. And I was like, oh, you know, but I need to try them on. So I went into the Loewe store on Champy Lisses in Paris and I saw these and it was an immediate purchase like I still was in my airport sweatsuit <laughs> no makeup nothing and I tried these on I knew I had to have them immediately I knew that I didn't need to go back to the store I knew I needed to get these and I don't even want to mess up because my hair is just like really laid right now but I don't want to mess it up but like like guys like these are on Neiman Marcus. Of course, everything will be linked, but like, let's get into the details. Can you guys see the details of these sunglasses? Like, do we see this gold cat eye? Like, this is probably one of the best Loewe sunglasses that they have ever made. And I just feel like there's one shade for everybody. Like, look at the details. Like, again, I could just have this on and it's just like, who, you, like, are you, that, that, that's it like but I love these I will show you guys the other colors that I tried in the store but I just felt like they have black and the gold they have like a clear kind of translucent color um with the gold black so I said black and this is I'm not sure if you could see it but this is tortoise so I wanted tortoise because I don't have many sunglasses that are a tortoise shell but with these you can wear them with black you can wear them with any color I just wanted to get, I feel like I, every shade of sunglasses I've been getting is black and I just got the St. Laurent Blaze Sunnies so I was like, these are definitely it. So I will link them down below. They're absolutely stunning. They're not too heavy and they're just amazing. I think it's, it's really just the details for me, like the details, like look at the details. That's it for me. So these were the two like accessory purchases from Paris. I'm going to show you guys, like I got I went to Nice Piece Vintage, I got like a jacket, so I'll show you guys that. I'm going to move so I can stand and show you the items. <laughs> um, so let's get the other items I got from Paris as well as all of the other random things that I got in this haul. I'm going to go in the other room and show you guys like standing up. But quite honestly, I don't feel like standing right now. But of course I will show how everything looks on the side here like I always do. I won't leave you guys hanging. Um, but I guess we'll start with the outside shopping. So Rabu, is it Rabu La Marche? I'm so, my French is horrible, and I'm sorry if I offend anyone with the, my pronunciation of things. But in that mall, I loved it. It was curated so beautifully, just with different brands. I felt like it was so easily shoppable. Paris shopping, it eats New York. It eats New York. I'm so sorry. It just, they just had the way they just make things and categorize things and just everything, everywhere you go, it's just like a shopping moment. But anyways, I stopped at the Acne Studios Boutique. Well, not boutique, but store within the department store. Um, and I got these jeans. They fit amazing. Um, I tried them on. You would have saw them in the vlog. They're amazing. They're, they say it's a vintage denim, but the fit is great. Like, I literally, they were on the rack. They fit me perfectly, and I need it. I just feel like all of my pants are either light and distressed, have holes, and I just feel like I needed a good pair of jeans. And I bought, like, the price. Of course, in Paris, it's a lot, a little bit, a lot cheaper, actually they were a good price over there but i felt like they were definitely much uh le least more less expensive i'm sorry less expensive than the mason margella jeans and i thought they fit really really good and i love that the color was perfect for how i want to wear them i feel like they were easy to style and like with blazers and stuff even even though i can't wear jeans to work i thought they were more i swear every pair of jeans i own is like distressed and ripped so i thought these fit me really really well and i just love the wide leg the length was perfect it just was calling my name and I just love them so much. Of course, I'll link them down below. I believe this is a waist 29 fit. 
Yep, uh, 29 waist, 32 length. Yes, that's why they're long and nice, but I love that I could wear them with heels. I love that they're not long, uh, so long where I can't wear sneakers. I just thought they were perfect, and I was obsessed when I saw them immediately. I was like, I have to have them. They're amazing. So before I get into the vintage pieces that I got, um, I went to Mango. The Mango there is beautiful, of course, and I got this stunning 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 red coat it's like a wool coat i'm not sure if you can see the material on the screen i'm trying to see if you guys can see but it's it's stunning um i got it in a size medium they didn't have a size large because they had this in the window and i knew that if i didn't get it like i would immediately regret it you guys know i'm a sunglass collector and i'm a coat collector as well so <laughs> uh, when i saw this i was like i knew i had to have it I'm feeling red. I'm loving the pops of colors of red with my accessories. It fit really well. I can't wait to wear this when it gets a little bit cooler out. It has the pockets on the side. I'll see. I didn't even check to see if this is online, but of course, everything will be linked down below so you guys can shop it. But it's it's perfectly weighted. It's like not too heavy, not too light, and the color was just like I feel like it was like the perfect red, right? Like it just was. Can you imagine this like as a monochromatic look with like my Gucci bag? What are we gonna even do? gonna be so good again size medium love this and this is from mango put that on the side <laughs> um so the next two pieces i got from nice piece vintage um the nice piece vintage store was probably one of the best that i went in paris i had went to another vintage store i forget the name um but they didn't have many things and i thought this nice piece vintage was very shoppable and they had like really cool items so i got this it's like a silk Snake skin print shirt. Um, I do have to get it short dry clean. It smells like it was just like in the vintage shop. You know that old smell. But um, I got this. It's 100% silk. Snake skin is giving Kate. It's giving Kate and it's not Kate. Um, I love this. I, it fits like very loose. I love that. I feel like I could wear it with like a pair of jeans that make it like super cute. I love snake skin. You guys know I've been feeling snake skin. So I love this. I just thought it was very, very easy and just like a fun top to have. And I love the fit of it. And it was 100% silk. So I went for it. So this I got from Nice Piece Vintage. This jacket I thought was so cool. It's like a leather bomber jacket. You guys know I love a jacket. Jackets, sunglasses. I collect. Um, this, I love the style of it. I love the shoulders. Um, I loved how easy it was. And again, I just wanted other jackets that were not like black, but like even just like, let me sit up a little bit. You see like just the effortlessness of this. And I'm like, I put this on with this. I'm just like, wait, this is like a look right here with a pair of boots. Love this. So I got this. Um, I just love the fit. It just fit me perfect. I love the effortlessness of it. You know, I went to St. Laurent and they had, um, of course, that leather jacket feel, you know, with the big shoulders. I feel like this was kind of giving that kind of style, but of course it was much less expensive and it was a nice vintage buy. Of course, I won't be able to link the vintage things, but I will try to find similar things so I can link them down below for you guys to shop. But I just love this. I was absolutely obsessed with this. This is a look. Ooh, love it. So next, let's get into um, the other random items that I got in the mail um along with announcing the giveaway okay so let's get to the random things i bought <laughs> here in the u.s um so i or i saw these shoes um and i was like i want to get into this trend i feel like this is a perfect way to get into the fur slash teddy trend um i always talk about charles and keith but this is actually my first time ordering from them and i picked these up how freaking adorable um, I got these in my true size because they have full sizes. Um, I'm using like a nine, nine and a half, so I got these in a nine. How fun are these? The nine is like the perfect fit. They're so comfortable, and I just love the actual shape of the like of the shoe. So I can't wait to wear this. They're so freaking cute. Um, they come in actually other colors because I actually think the actual style of the shoe is like really, really cool. Like just because I just like this front piece, the back. Um, so it's furry, it's fun, um, and I feel like it's a cool way to try out the trends without breaking the bank. So I just couldn't wait to show you guys these. These are so, so cute, and they came in while I was away in Paris, but I love. Um, let me know what you think of these. I can't wait to style these. I'm like, oh, I can't wait to wear them. 
Of course, you put, like in New York, it's just been raining a lot. So I can't wear these in the rain. So I'm just waiting for the perfect fall weather to come in because obviously with the fur, that could be like a messy thing. But I just love these. I thought they were super cute and adorable. And they're comfortable. So I would say go with your true size. I didn't feel, I felt like if I got a 10, it would have been a little too big. And they fit perfectly and they're comfortable. So I love these. The next thing, um, I heard about the brand Brahmin. Um, they actually gifted me this bag and I love it. It's from their new holiday collection. Um, I wanted a bag that was, they have really great bags in different like pops of color, like blue. Um, I'll show you guys some of the clips of, from their holiday collection. But this, I was like, oh, this is so different. It's giving me a little like a Dior like vibe, um, like vintage's vibe. Let me grab it so that I can show you guys. So this bag I picked up, they were able to send to me, and I just think it's so gorgeous because it's just different and has like every color. Like look at this, look at the details of this. Let's back it up a little bit. It has every color. I love the satchel style because I can take it to work with me. Um, they have so many different shapes, and the price point at Brahmin is so, so affordable. I believe this bag is, this bag is called the Duxbury Satchel Bag in the Renaissance renaissance to Melbourne style and this bag retails for $3.15 which is such a great price and it's leather it's such a great price and I just thought this was so stunning like just looking at all the colors I can kind of wear it in the spring and just have different pops because you guys know I'm trying to I'm trying to add to my handbag collection different things without it being black because like you know I reach for the black I reach for like white I just kind of want to have bolder things in my collection and this is amazing and it's so beautiful and I couldn't wait to share it with you guys and I just love like the style of it and I just love that it has every color that I could possibly think of wearing in the fall is in this bag. Um, and I'll show you guys on the side too here. It comes with a strap, which is really good. With this, because you guys know I wanted that, uh, what is it called? The Louis Vuitton Petite, I forget what it's called, but I wanted this style of handle on the top. I probably will not wear it with the strap because I just don't need it. But inside it's a lot of room. We have pockets on the side. You can literally fit everything. So I don't even have to do what fits inside. Everything will fit inside. You can bring a book. You can put, I could put my Louis agenda in here. Um, Cause sometimes I don't carry that because it gets heavy and it doesn't fit in a lot of my smaller bags, but I could fit that in here and anything that I possibly want to take. But I just love the details of it. Um, they have other colors, but I just love this style because I was looking for a satchel bag, but I just thought this was perfectly fun and beautiful. Let me know what you guys think. And be sure to check out Brahmin. They have such affordable price points, great for gift giving, great for the holidays, and great for yourself if you want to treat yourself but you don't want to break the bank. This is beautiful. Love it. So the next two things, I don't want to say they're boring things, but again, I'm like, I've been buying all these things and you know, I got these great bags that I got. And I was like, you know, I need some basics. And you guys know that I love Uniqlo when it comes to basics. I feel like they get basics right and they are the perfect price point. So I picked up these two sweaters. Again, just regular sweater. Um, gray. Fits perfect. I got a size medium. This one is the premium lamb's wool. And this was $49.90. But again, these are the things that you want to reach for when you're getting dressed, especially for the morning when I'm going to work. I'm like, why do I have all these pants and no sweaters? I just felt like fall is kind of here and I just needed to re-up on these basics. So I love this. I probably will end up going back and getting a few more colors because I love, I love a crew neck sweater because you can also play with your accessories and like your necklaces and things like that. And it's just a perfect sweater to have. I'm like, I'm like, why don't I have any tops for work? So I got this and I also got this one and it's like a knit, what is this called? It's called the fleece crew neck. So it feels like fleece. Um, it's soft. It's very, very soft. It feels amazing. I got this in a small because this seems to have run a little bit bigger. Like you can see how big and loose it is. But I got it in white because I feel like it will go with so many things. Um, and it fits really good. It feels good. And you just can't go wrong. I just love crew neck sweaters. So I got these and I also picked up the pants that I showed you guys, <clears throat> sorry, from Urban Outfitters um, and the Olive. They didn't come in yet, but I did pick them up because they were on sale and I love those pants and I feel like when I find pants that fit me, I like to just go <laughs> for multiple colors because it's so hard for me to find really good pants. So that's the random things I picked up. But yeah, be sure to check out Brahmin and definitely get those shoes from Charles O'Keefe. They're so cute, but look at this, so cute. 
right guys so thank you guys for watching the haul let me know which item was your favorite so let's announce the giveaway and the live date that we're doing um you guys let me know um the time if it works for you but i'm thinking i'll tell you that after but I'll, i'm thinking like 6 p.m is like a good time like on a sunday because during the week i probably will miss it between my work schedule so let's announce the giveaway so the giveaway we're going to do another 150 dollars gift card um to store of choice i figure let's do either zara you guys love zara i'm trying to think of the places that you guys shop with my link so zara 150 to zara h&m or sephora or ulta it could be either four of those. I don't care. Whatever you guys want, um, 150 Of course, you have had to make it this far to be entered in the giveaway. So what you're going to do is like this video. You have to be subscribed to this channel. You have to be subscribed. Um, we're going to leave a comment, a nice comment, of course. And we're going to leave three black hearts um, to enter the giveaway. The giveaway is going to be starting today, which this video will go up on the 15th. October 15, 2023, and it will go until October 21st, and we'll close it at 12 p.m. Eastern Time. So again, directions, um, leave three black hearts, leave a comment, you have to be subscribed to this channel, and you must like this video. And then we're going to go live on the 22nd. Let's do 6 p.m. Eastern Time. Let me know if that's a good time for you guys, but I think we'll go with that. We could do 6 p.m. or we could do 7 p.m. If that works for you guys. And I feel like if you join the live, I'm going to have like a little a little mini giveaway for my people, my beauties in there and that live chat. So let's do it. Um, enter. Tell me if that time works. Good luck on the giveaway. I love giving it to you guys because you guys give me all the love. So good luck. Um, thank you guys for all your support. Be safe and be well. Bye.